Hello everyone, welcome. Hello everyone, my name is Travis and welcome back to Resident Evil 2. Uh, uh, I'm playing this game again because uh, I'm gonna be honest with you, I don't really feel like playing anything else at the moment. And if you got a problem with that, not my problem. I am very happy to play this game. Any time of the day, any day of the week. Just how it is. Just how it's gonna be. Suck on that. Uh, anyway, so, <laughs> so, uh, yeah, man, I don't know. I just want to, uh, I guess I just want to play, man. I don't, I don't want to fiddle around with a bunch of crap all the time. Just, you know, have this become some kind of ridiculous, some kind of ridiculousness, you get what I'm saying? I don't even know what I'm saying right now, but I'm going to be honest with you. I'm just trying to play a game, you know? Way I see it, I'm just trying to play a game. You can't stop me. You can't stop. Oh, I think I know what's going on here. I thought I knew what was going on here, but I did not. Okay. Um. All right. Are my options. There we go. Fantastic. Didn't take too long at all, did it? I was just kind of fumbling around, but I did it. In the neighborhood, you'll find it. Sherry, all right? For now. I swear, you bastard, if you hurt her. Stupid kid. If you just hadn't dropped that fucking thing, I could let you go. Don't worry, Sherry. It'll be all over soon. There has to be a way out of here. You are a brave and adventurous little girl. It's not creepy. It all has something on it. You're telling me she couldn't reach in here and pull this up? Dude! This tape, this tape isn't even on the wall. <laughs> what? Okay, well, let's take a look. Let's see what we got. It's kind of an odd place to hide something. I mean, if I was a cop, I'd suspect drugs, but, you know, that is, it is what it is, right? Okay, well, I think I get the gist of what this is all about. Okay, that fits like a charm. Oh no, here's where it gets fucking stupid, huh? Okay, 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 so then it must be... Uh... Maybe... Okay, nope, I was wrong. Oh god, is it gonna be another one of these fucking puzzles that I'm never able to solve? Because I have a bad habit of playing games with puzzles I can never solve. Okay, I think we're making headway. Thought we were making headway, I guess not. Oh! Is this it? I did it! I figured that would take longer, but I guess, honestly, it was only a matter of time. I've only got four blocks. I mean, why, why would you even need to do that? I mean, 
even as a little kid, you should be able to pull that kind of shit off. Like, it's just tape, dude. What is this? It's a fucking creeper den is what it is. You kidding me? Oh, yeah, that's definitely quiet. Oh, this must be the, um... This must be the orphanage. Oh, yeah, did did he say that? Yeah, yeah, this must be, the, like, the orphanage or whatever that he funded, I guess. Makes sense. Creep goes to a creepy place to, en to enact his creepy plans. Crawl through there, Sherry. Ew. Never had the makings of an adversity. <laughs> whatever. Sopranos quote. What? Nothing in here. Okay. Apparently. Allegedly. Nothing in there. Oh, I walked right past it. An ominous noise to be making. And do you move faster while you're crouched? She do. She moves faster when she's crouched. I mean, I don't really have a reason to sneak, do I? There's nobody here. That must be the door out of here. Darn it! I need the key. Well, yes, Sherry. Doors need keys. Wait, why do you need a key from the inside? I didn't really pay attention to that. Hold on, let me collect this. Tom's Diary. February 5th. It's been two months since I sent that letter to Oliver, and all I've gotten back is nada. Zip! Then again, they're all like that once they get adopted. But he's living like a king in some fancy folks home and forgotten all about us. I really thought Oliver was different, that he'd be my friend for life. Guess I'm just a fool. Anne sat all the little kids down and told him a story today. She said all the kids that get adopted are turned into food for the boogeymen? Who would tell a kid that? That's why no one hears from them ever again. Not sure where she gets her ideas from, but she's sure got the mind for writing trashy horror novels. There's something weird going on around here, and it's not just because of Anne's stories. Don't get me wrong, I've been in worse places, and this place is funded by some big drug company. But why can't we call people or go outside? Why are there so many doctors around? What's with all those shots every day? It's almost like we're... I'm getting adopted. Me. Most people go for younger kids, so I figured I was too old. But I can't say I'm not a little happy. Who am I kidding? I'm totally psyched. I say goodbye to this place on the 20th. I'm gonna try my best to be a good son. Someone my new mom and pop can be proud of. Oliver came back in the middle of the night all messed up screaming help me and stuff. I didn't even recognize him at first. His face was peeling and melted off. He's with the teachers and doctors now. It's just a skin thing they say. We'll get better soon and then we can go on adventures again. I guess that's it. Why do you why do you need the key to the inside? Oh, they did okay, they did say that they can't leave or whatever, so Yeah, I guess they installed an interior lock. That's kind of weird, but okay. Oh no, it's him. Kind of weird that you'd have that window right there. Like, what's the point of having a window inside of a- inside of a house? You feel what I'm saying? You get what I'm getting at? <laughs> Blake's diary. If you're reading this, go call- go call Khalees. Boogeyman's here, eating everybody. Many bark boogeyman's here. Elk. They're calming. Elk me mommy. Well, it doesn't look like mommy's coming, little Bobby. But worry not, every Bobby knows. Huh. You know, I think in the original game that was the mayor's daughter or something, but I, I wouldn't be able to tell you. Where you going, Sherry? I told you to stay put. You need to learn to listen. Leave me alone! Just please! Time to teach some manners. Uh. Ah! 
Oh, Sherry, it's time to go. It's time to go, Sherry. Okay. Time to run. Time to run, Sherry. Time to get the fuck out of here. Help! Somebody, please! Ain't nobody coming to help, Sherry. It's just you and the world. Oh, yeah? You want to fucking bet? You want to bet, bastard? Oop. Fucking piece of trash. Oof, he came in in a huff. He must really be angry about that acid he threw in his face. It's all over now. Oop. Doors locked. Uh, yeah, the door's locked, so what? What's your point? <clears throat> Look, man, you, you don't have to throw the kids' stuff around. Show yourself! I know you're in here. The longer it takes me to find you, the worse it's gonna be. Ooh, that was so close. <clears throat> you are a bastard, aren't you? I guess I can't go that way. But he did open up a new oh God. Oh God. path for me. A new lease on life, it's perhaps. Just, gotta be here somewhere. just don't turn around, bud. Just don't turn God around. Damn it. Just don't turn around. Everything will be okay. I saw that. Oh, you are just... Unbelievable. Oh, shit! Okay. Son of a bitch. There's literally nowhere to go from here. That was this a dead is end. Last fucking chance. Yeah, see, he's Show right yourself. over there. There's nowhere now. else to go. That door's blocked. That door's locked. Oh, oh, it burns. I bet it would, you dummy. How very irresponsible of you. You should know by now what I am capable of. If I'm able to get out of that shit room, you should know that I am a... Oop! Oh! Here he comes! Oop! Oh shit! Look, we can debate this whole existence for a little while longer if you'd like, but I, I'm, I, I gotta, you know, I gotta run. I gotta take a jog. Look, I need to. I need to. I need to. I need to get out of here. So long, little bitch. Oh, what is that? How could you lock it from the outside and the inside? Oh, he's in a mad fucking rush to get to me. Go, 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 Sherry. You can do this. You can make it. You I'm are coming, smart. Sherry. Where'd you get the axe? Where'd you get the axe, you fucking bastard? Get over here, you bitch. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. Oh, shit. Good to see you again, Claire. We've got unfinished business. What are you talking about? Don't waste my fucking time! Bring me the pendant, or Sherry dies. 
pendant. What do you need it for? Do you want the girl to die? Fine. Where are you? The orphanage. The orphanage? Where is that? In the neighborhood. You'll find it. Is Sherry all right? For now. I swear, you bastard, if you hurt her. Are you serious? Damn it. Claire, you have no idea what Sherry has just been just through. Just you wait, asshole. Oh. He's not waiting for anything now. He's dead. He is dead. Mr. X, you just don't give a fuck, do you? You just you just stomping around like a fucking bat. You don't care about anything. No matter what happens, you're just going to continue on like life is like life is just happening. That was a little concerning how that noise happened there, but I'm gonna not pay attention to that. Now that we have the permit, we can go down. We can get to the orphanage. I'm almost convinced that there is a dog in here. Unless Leon and Ada killed them all. Okay, it looks like we're free. All right, fair enough. You again? Look, I have no sympathy for you. No, 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 no! Oh shit! You bastard! Hey, look. Okay, I I've had enough of you. You can chase me all you want, but the fact of the matter is, oh, there's an herb there. Oh, I kind of want that herb. Hey, look, calm, calm it down, all right? You had your chance. He's really coming after me, isn't he? Oh, shit! Wrong place to be! Wrong place to go! Wrong place for me. You know, oh my god, I took so much damage. You know, those grenades wouldn't just pop in his mouth and like do no damage. That would explode his head. That's that's a that's a lethal weapon. Like his head would go pop. Oh, we're right above where uh, Leon and Ada were. This is from the uh, from the first part of the original game. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Look, 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 look. You can do me a favor and just die, or you can keep being a nuisance like you are now, and that's how it'll be. How's it going, bud? Oh. Oh, you, you got shot and died. Well, some of us get shot and live, some of us get shot and die. Oh. Oh! Holy shit! These boys are taking up some ammo, aren't they? Okay. What left hip? Goodbye. You're gone. Oh! So dead! And what's left of you now? What have you made of yourself? Have you done anything with your life? What have you become? Another corpse lining the streets? Ugh. I can do this. Oh, I like the sound of the bullet drops. That's kind of cool. Are you guys, are you gonna die? This is a lot of ammo to spend on on some dogs. Okay, you're gone, thank you. That was a service for me, thank you. Appreciate that, much obliged. I don't know if I have the, uh... All right, let's just try to make it without using that. 
Oh, that's gonna be a that's gonna be a tough run in it. Let's just be safe. Better safe than to be sorry. Wait a second. Okay, I could have sworn I saw something else in here, but I did not. And that's okay. On then where you at what's oh there you are oh sorry boy I had to put you down oh yeah I should have been paying attention for that rattling oh well whatever it's gotta be anything else in anything else here for me nothing all right, let's book it. Hang it on, looks sir. more like a graveyard if you ask me. Jesus, criminy. broken off so on and so forth. oh oh the locks broken off hello I have the pendant do you does she she oh, okay it's not hanging off sherry sherry are you here I think I wouldn't notice you son you think I'd forget something like that Sorry, Claire, I saw a low-poly version of yourself, and I got scared. I think SMG bullets inside of a basket is kind of a... kind of an odd thing. Regarding the incident in question, I'm glad to report it has all been taken care of. On February 19th, Test Subject 628 escaped from the lab and broke, our broke into our facility. 628 was originally from this facility's candidate pool and apparently returned in hope of seeking help. 628 was quickly detained by our staff. As 628 was undergoing one of the lab's clinical trials, there was a distinct possibility that he had brought the virus with him. So he disposed of all our Test Subject candidates as a precaution. Oh, no. Their speedy disposal was conducted by the security team to whom I'd like to extend my thanks. As for our neighbors, we told them that due to the building's dilapidated state, we have tempor temporarily removed all the moved all of the children to a different orphanage for their safety. Oh, that's so sick. As to the future of this facility, once it has become become fully decontaminated, I plan to resume secure securing more test subjects. That's just so odd. That this is more like a decontamination room than a, than a shower. So what did these kids use for bathing? They all have to take that shower? That's disgusting. Wash flush. Okay. Is there anything hiding over here? Maybe in the fridge? No, nothing. Lots of little cribs in here. So that's so that's so bad. They disposed of the children. And they treat them as if they're monsters, but they're not monsters, they're just kids. And if they're all getting infected with the same thing, why would oh. uh, Holy shit. Your fault! What? It took too long! What happened? Uh, oh god. Uh, get, get off me! Jesus Christ! 
Hey, you know what comes around goes around, right? That's one for me. And there's one for Sherry. Suck on that, you son of a bitch. Quick save. Real quick save. Fast save. So fast. Any goodies in here for me? Anything I can take? Anything I should need before I leave? Oh. Kind of weird that he has a basement underneath whatever he was doing in here. Oh, man. Sherry! Where are you? Look, if Sherry's down here... Sherry! I'll be right there! I spoke too soon. I Come knew that go. boom, and I was like, fight or flight. Claire! It's behind you! Don't stop! No, I think it's behind you, Sherry. Look, you need to catch up or I'm gonna leave you behind, okay? Oh shit, he's right there! Wake up. Wake up. Open your eyes. Hold still. I'm not infected. What the? Sherry? Where's Sherry? Sherry. Sherry's fine. Do you know Sherry? It's an impressive display of strength. What happened to her? We have to assess the situation. Who are you? I'm Claire. I didn't foresee this. Excuse me. Where is she? Hello? What? Where oh, is she? Annette. Tell me, what happened to William? I don't know. Who is, who is that? The creature responsible for this. Can you help me find Sherry? Seems to be evolving much faster than expected. Where are you going? Look, I don't have time to play 20 questions. Everything's under control. I need to find Sherry. My daughter is not your concern. What a bitch. All right. Oh. Oh. I thought I was special. Where'd I thought Sherry I found go? something. Sherry's I wasn't expecting that door to open. <laughs> okay. G-Virus clinical trial will be entering its final phase very soon. Before G, the new creature that will suppress humans is born. Allow me to predict a few things about its biology and biological functions. Intelligence. The subject's intelligence. Let me point this out to you here. For those of you who don't know, and you should know, if you've been watching this game series on other channels, or you've played the games yourself. Um, never mind. I, you know what? I'll just read through this. You'll get what I'm getting at. Subjects' intelligence will begin to drop immediately with their linguistic abilities disappearing within a matter of days. Finally, they will lose their capacity to reason and their humanity. G will be a creature of pure instinct driven only by a need to re survive and reproduce. Physical abilities. Due to its unusually accelerated cell division, evolution, it will be highly adaptable to any environment. Furthermore, with its amazing ability to repair itself through regeneration, it will be extremely difficult to completely kill with any conventional small firepower. G's most remarkable feature will be its intense desire to reproduce. Basically incredibly horny. It will instinctively search out humans with DNA that closest matches its own and implant an embryo in them. 
family. But the chances of success are very low, and if the DNA is not a close enough of a match, an underdeveloped G creature will be produced instead. I suppose the only ones who might be a close enough of a match would be any biological children of the subject, though. So, uh, yeah. Lots of that nasty stuff going on. Anyway. It's time to end the video. You know it. I know it. I've got an item box. Actually, let me see what's beyond this door real quick. Nothing. Alright, no point. And dump these bad boys away really quick. And, uh, yeah. So that's it. Thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate you sticking with me through this. I hope you enjoyed the video. And if you did enjoy the video, please like on it and comment down below and tell me what you think. Subscribe to the channel if you want to see more to keep up to date with everything that's going on. Share the videos to spread the good word, and I'll see you in the next one. Take care, friends.